Hello, it's always the day after, the day after, that you start to feel a little bit, oh, oh that aches when you've been on the road gigging and stuff. So today I thought, I'll take it easy, I'll relax a little bit. And then uh, we've been breaking up the wardrobes upstairs. She's sending me out to buy new wardrobes. I've got a nip down the bank. I'm gonna go to my dad's to drop the gear off to make room. Probably a million other things. Oh, and as I was breaking up the wardrobe, I I put my fist through it. So, that hurts. I think yesterday I said we're gonna make these super positive. Wrong BT, let's, let's go. Well, the first thing I did was go to the shop for Gemma. Second thing, there's the old man. I've gotta drop all the gear off. Make some room for her new wardrobes that she had me dismantling. The reason I didn't film that this morning, which went on for quite some time, was because we were mainly in our pants. Hi! Hmm? Why am I offloading all the gear, did you say? Yeah, well, it's probably for some new idea. For a new idea she's had. Oh, good, it's starting to rain. Yeah, hey? What is this? Well, I was dismantling wardrobes this morning. Dismantling them? Yeah, those the new one, ones. The new ones that we took ages building. Yeah. Well, she wants to change it, don't she? What, for more, um... For just some different wardrobes. What's the... <laughs> so, they reserved in shelves. Argos. <laughs> got more shells in them, I think. Let's see how long they'll last, a week, two weeks? Yeah, yeah. What colour? Cream. Cream? Yeah. So I've got to offload all this gear, and then go and get some new wardrobes. Oh, and then I'll have to make them with my bad back. I'll tell you what, I am being a superb husband today, because... So far, I've cleared all this off, i made lots of space, I've been to the bank for her, I've been to the shop for her, you wouldn't have seen that. Now, I've got to go and get the wardrobes. What a wonderful, wonderful husband. And you're back on there. And I've got two wardrobes, one set of drawers in the car, the other set isn't in until tomorrow, so I've got to come back tomorrow and do it. Was he? has text me. He's been back to work today, so he's having to adjust because he's classing the gig we went on as a holiday and now he's back to work after his holiday. So he's not very he's not very happy about it. And I've just told him I'm in Argos lifting stuff on my own without his help. He said I'm just getting back to it after my holiday. Back to the wench. Let's go. And I just saw some friends who uh, who gave me a lift. So I wasn't on my own after all. Brilliant. Wonderful news. I've got the stuff upstairs. Gemma's already not waiting for me building new wardrobes, so I've got to go upstairs and help her. But, Robbie Williams. Now, we know I do Blobby Williams. He's just releasing his new album. I've got the first single. And the new album, The Heavy Entertainment Show. Blobby Williams, the heavyweight king of pop. Sometimes I get excited because sometimes these things just write themselves. The Heavy Entertainment Show. <laughs> Amazing. If there's one thing I love, it's peas. I love peas. That's in chicken burgers, homemade chips, that's dinner on the make. I can now confirm that January 28th, when I'm at Huntington Hall, there's Blobby Williams. I can confirm the support act. Yes, I can. You are hearing it here first, that supporting me, I have the UK's very best, the best, Dolly Parton tribute act. Working now to survive. Wow. Come on, who can dance? Working to survive. Anyway, Lolly Parton is supporting me, Huntington Hall, with Blobby Williams. Get online. You don't want to miss it. It's going to be eight. Dinner's in the bag. There's Hogan. You're right, mate. Let's go and have a look at these new. Jesus. He's got one on him. What's knocked me down the stairs? What are you doing? What are you doing? Right, let's have a look. Oh, new wardrobes are in. We had the solid wardrobes before, but we've tried to make more room. So we've gone for the canvas wardrobes. And the beds over here. And on top of that, these are the bedside drawers that I bought. That are the size of Manhattan. Compared to the old bedside drawer over there. I don't think we need to. Not really a bedside drawer, is it? Looking good, Bab. To get in there. I can't film Gemma because she's in her pyjamas, 
So I am. Hang on a sec. If I stand and you can talk to them through me. Okay. Go. What do you want me to say? <laughs> you don't get the painting in the background. Oh yeah, see that there? The wardrobes were there, so we didn't paint, we just went round them. So we've got to paint a wall. <laughs> no, I've checked. I'm I think it looks a bit trendy like that. No, I'm going to be um, painting it what? between the whole room. So you'll be able to see it when it's finished with the pictures up and the clock and everything. I said don't put stuff on the canvas, because it's only canvas. That's to take downstairs. Already stuff on there. Oh, that's all right then. That means it won't dent it. What a surprise. Who's this followed us upstairs and almost killed me on the stairs? It's Ogun. What are you after, mate? Really? What is it you want? <laughs> Just checking out the bed. People do ask, does he go on the bed? There's your answer. Ogun. Why are you buffing at me? Ogun. Why are you buffing at me, eh? Hey? Now Gemma is upstairs, still faffing with things, when I found these in the cupboards, oh dear. Mm. Nice. Right, hello. It's been a weird day, hasn't it? It's been like, um, it's been really busy off camera, but there's not been loads of stuff to film, so... I suppose sometimes things are going to be like that. What I've got to do, and I worry about it a little bit, is I've got to stop having to explain if I do a shorter video. Do you know? Do you know what I mean? Even he's bored of me. If I sometimes do a video that's not very long, then I shouldn't really worry too much about it, should I? And what I don't want to do is just put stuff in here for the sake of it, just to fill time. So, but I've had quite a busy day today with stuff off camera, like I said. Ooh. I'm so tired. Gemma's getting herself in the bath. How do you say bath? Bath or bath? She's having a bath or a bath. But I'm quite tired and I don't fancy like having a late night because I don't usually get to bed very much before one o'clock, two o'clock. Right now it's ten past ten. So to go to bed at this time would be quite, quite early. And I think I need it. That's twice I've yawned so rude so i'm gonna do a sign off thank you again for watching thank you for subscribing if you've subscribed it's not normal is it that oh dear um i think that's enough for one day be good to each other love i can't even, i got my arms underneath me be good to each other love each other see you tomorrow i oh, got the energy